Hello everyone. Out of all the indoor playgrounds catered to toddlers that I am aware of in the Northeast Florida area, Sprouts Play and Learn would have to be my favorite since it does the best job catering to a wide variety of ages as well as having the most toys stocked up to pair up with each room theme. Play Factory and Cafe would be my number two choice. There's lots of things for kids to do there, as well as lots of toys to go with the themes of each room. The smoothies there are really good. My only complaint is that the train set was missing pieces. Number three, the little social. Though there was lots of things for the kids to do there, I would have liked for there to have been more toys for the kids to play with. Storytime was pretty cool. The chicken salad sandwich there is terrible. Number four, sensory town. Like that there was tables set up with papers for the kids to draw on. The giant slide in the disco ball room was pretty cool too. Was not impressed with the rest of the playground though. Number 5. The Nesting Collective Though the water table there was cool, I was not impressed with the rest of the playground. Number 6. The Playful Family Inc. Not very much toys were stocked at the different areas which was disappointing. The only thing my daughter liked to play with there was the mailbox. The events that they host here are pretty cool, though. The Enchanted Cottage would be in last place due to this place having the least amount of toys stocked up at each section of the playground out of all of the indoor playgrounds I've been to. The only exception would be the kitchen area, as the Nesting Collective and the Playful Family Inc. had less kitchen toys stocked up than this place did. Though it was cool that there was a pretend grill at the top of the climbing structure, there was no toy set up there for the kids to play with at the grill. The staff was the most disorganized here compared to all the other playgrounds I've been to. I brought it up to the owner that I had saw online that the day I went there was supposed to be craft day. The owner said that she had the days mixed up and didn't realize that it was craft day today. She quickly got things set for craft day. All that was there for craft day was a paper tree for the kids to decorate. Overall, was not impressed. If you guys liked my video, please click like and subscribe.